probably best to approach birthday monsters cautiously in pencil. Then we'll move on to ink. So we'll start with some eyes and we'll do some big pupils on those eyes because big pupils look really cute next to long needle sharp fangs. Hmm. And tucked in behind those fangs, we'll put a little gift wrapped box with ribbon because birthday monsters really like surprises. They like to jump out and surprise you with stuff. So we'll also do a ceremonial horn rack and let's add some fur in here. The fur comes off to either side of the eyes and between the eyes and around the mouth here. You know, they say birthday monsters often reflect the person whose birthday it is. And here we have a monster who is uh, cute and crouching and voracious. Uh, and when we feel like the monster is taking shape, we'll come in with a thick line marker and rough out the basic shapes of that monster, including the fur and the fangs. Oh, I see we're getting some attention from the other monsters. This makes the picture much easier to see, the black ink here. I'm using my thin line pen now, and I'm going in and doing wrinkles and the grain, the coarse fur here coming down over the lips. Yeah, those other monsters are getting interested. I think I'll add those ribbons in thick line marker because that makes them stand out against the fur a little more. Now let's see here. This monster's really decorated up for this party. Let's add the ribbon in. And oh, look at that. Didn't I say they like surprises? There is a cupcake tucked in there into that dark mouth behind the fangs resting on the tongue there. Oh, and there's a couple little eyes in there too, keeping an eye on those surprises. Let's see, taste buds, and now the crouching legs and claws. These monsters get all painted and decorated up for the parties. Oh, look at that. Now don't forget the bloodshot eyes, because they go to a lot of parties. They get a lot of candle smoke in their eyes. Happy birthday in Monster Script. You can also add the name of the person whose birthday it is. That's always nice in these decorations. Don't forget a monster's party hat. The other monsters are bringing their own hats. And we'll clean up a little with this eraser because this monster wants to look its best when it goes to the party. Sign it, include the name of the person whose birthday it is, and maybe the monster has a little message for them. They can say it now. And there you go. Happy birthday. This video presents generic birthday monsters only. Viewers may wish to add celebrant specific details at their own discretion. Comics Workshop is not responsible for any resulting monster rampages or violation of local silliness ordinances, especially related to birthday party monster bans. Consult your local cartoonist to see if birthday party monsters may be right for you. Some restrictions may apply.